Hey guys, Gary Lucas with Obsidian Painting, and today we're going to do a review on the Vallejo Liquid Gold series. And this series is, isn't is just gold, it has silvers in it too, which I have yet to try, but I'm going to pick some up. Now this is an alcohol-based metallic paint. Now it has doesn't have real gold in it, but it has actual metallic flakes in it, suspended in an alcoholic medium. Um, so you do have to use alcohol to thin it, like rubbing alcohol, isopropanol alcohol. Uh, do not use water, Vallejo says, that if you use water, water it will rust instantly. Don't do that. Uh, as you can see, it's already super thin, and look how easily that applies. Ugh, it blows my mind every time I use this paint. So please, just go and try this. If you're looking, it's really cheap for the bottles too. One bottle of this stuff is roughly the same retail price as one bottle of GW paint. Okay? You cannot beat that, right? So go check this stuff out. Or at least it's relatively close to the GW price. Um, this goes on super smooth. I'm using three paints here. I'm using red gold, old gold, and white gold. Uh, I use this dedicated brush to this, similar to how I would use dedicated brushes for metallic paints, because I don't want this paint mixing with other paint, but most importantly, I don't want water mixing with this paint. So I use a dedicated brush th to this, and I f think it works pretty well. I, I got a pretty decent brush for it. Uh, I really enjoy the Winsor Newton Cotman Series 4. Um, my you know my basic painting I wouldn't use it if I were using say uh, uh, doing a more detail more blending and stuff but as you can see because it's so thin it actually naturally kind of just blends itself uh, now you can thin it down as I said with isopropyl alcohol um, and you know don't drink it don't lick it if you are using this stuff do not lick your brush there is uh, uh, the isopropyl alcohol in it it will kill you don't do it please and make sure you go check out CanadianWarGaming.com. They sell this stuff. Go check them out.